All right, guys, tonight I'm just going to do a quick video on who does it better, curiosity, kind of things I've wondered. So on the left, this map here, this is the injector balance from a 2011-2015 Kawasaki ZX-10. And over here on the right, this is the injector balance map out of a 2017 GSX-R 1000 and 1000R. All right, so... First thing I noticed, you know, like over on the left, Kawasaki keeps their lower injectors at 70% of total load all the way up the red line, which kind of, I mean, that makes sense to me. I would think maybe the lower, I mean, <clears throat> more upper injector might atomize better, but I suspect Kawasaki's done some testing or maybe they know why this is. I'm not sure yet hope to test this when I actually can ride my bike again and winter's not here. But on the right, we look at Suzuki, and Suzuki kind of ramps down to 20% load on the lower injector and back up to 40 as it gets towards red line. So if we just do a quick comparison just between them, and about the same RPM, same throttle position, Suzuki and and Kawasaki chose to do their injector balance different on the higher loads. All right, and just in case if you're not sure or don't know what the injector balance map actually does, this is a percentage map of what the lower injectors carry versus what the upper injectors carry. So let's we'll use Suzuki since it's more round that and I can see it at 85% throttle. After 8,000 RPM, it'll slowly ramp up to, by 8,800 RPM, the lower injector is 60% of the low, which means that the upper injector is providing 40% of the fuel. So, I hope to be able to test this at the drag strip once I can ride and just see, you know, play around with these fuel balances and try to figure out if it makes any difference in power. Um, hopefully I can see that on the time or maybe chosen between speeds, RPM ramp ups. Anyway, if you like this video, like, subscribe, please give me a thumbs up. Give me some feedback on what you think. If you've actually dynoed this or know the answer, just please provide it. All right. Thank you.